The ilium, ischium and pubis form the hip bone. They meet one another at the acetabulum, here. The hip bones articulate with the sacrum at the sacroiliac joints. They also articulate with one another anteriorly at the symphysis pubis. The ilium, which is the upper flattened part of the bone, has the iliac crest. It ends in front at the anterior superior iliac spine and behind at the posterior superior iliac spine. The iliac tubercle lies about 5 cm behind. Below the anterior superior iliac spine is a prominence, the anterior inferior iliac spine, a similar prominence, the posterior inferior iliac spine, is located below the posterior superior iliac spine. Above and behind the acetabulum, the ilium has a large notch, the greater sciatic notch. Here it is. The ischium is L-shaped and it has an upper thicker part, the body, and a lower thinner part, the ramus. The ischial spine projects from the posterior border of the ischium and intervenes between the greater and lesser sciatic notches. The ischial tuberosity forms the posterior aspect of the lower part of the body of the bone. The greater and lesser sciatic notches are converted into greater and lesser sciatic foramina by the presence of the sacrospinose and sacrotuberose ligaments. The pubis can be divided into a body, a superior ramus and inferior ramus. The bodies of two pubic bones articulate with each other in the midline anteriorly at the symphysis pubis. The superior ramus joins the ilium and ischium at the acetabulum, and the inferior ramus joins the ischial ramus below. The obturator foramen in life is filled by the obturator membrane. The pubic crest forms the upper border of the body of the pubis and it ends laterally as the pubic tubercle here. On the outer surface of the hip bone is a deep depression called the acetabulum that articulates that with the spherical head of the femur to form the hip joint. The inferior margin of the acetabulum is deficient and is marked by the acetabular notch. The articular surface of the acetabulum is limited to a horseshoe-shaped area and is covered with hyaline cartilage. The flow of the acetabulum is non-articular and is called the acetabular fossa. Let's review the main anatomical structures again. This is the ilium, ischium and pubis. Iliac crest, anterior superior iliac spine, posterior superior iliac spine, iliac tubercle, anterior inferior iliac spine, posterior inferior iliac spine, greater sciatic notch, Laser sciatic notch, ischial tuberosity, ischial spine, obturator foramen, body of pubis, superior pubic ramus, inferior pubic ramus, pubic crest, pubic tubercle, acetabulum, acetabular notch, and finally the acetabular fossa.